Imagine a world where humanitarian aid reaches the most remote corners of the planet with unprecedented speed and efficiency. What if drones, powered by innovative technology, could deliver life-saving supplies and aid in disaster zones? Join us as we explore Chikambutso's aircraft, a revolutionary concept reimagining humanitarian aid. Did you know that millions of people around the world lack access to essential resources due to logistical challenges? This video unveils Chikambutso's aircraft, a cutting-edge solution designed to overcome these obstacles. It promises to revolutionize the way humanitarian aid is delivered. The sleek, futuristic design of Chikambutso's aircraft is unlike anything seen before. Its aerodynamic curves and lightweight frame hint at its advanced engineering. The aircraft's smooth, almost silent operation sets it apart from traditional drones. At first glance, it appears as if it belongs in a sci-fi film. But this is real, a tangible innovation built for real-world impact. The most groundbreaking feature is its self-powered system. Unlike conventional aircraft, it doesn't rely on fossil fuels or external charging. Instead, it harnesses a proprietary energy technology developed by Chikambutso himself. This system converts ambient energy into sustainable power, allowing indefinite flight. The implications for humanitarian missions are staggering. No more fuel shortages grounding critical aid deliveries. No more logistical nightmares in setting up charging stations in disaster zones. The aircraft simply flies, self-sustaining wherever it's needed. Its ability to reach remote and challenging terrains is unmatched. Mountainous regions, dense jungles, and flood-stricken areas are no longer inaccessible. Traditional vehicles and helicopters often struggle in these environments. But Chikambutso's aircraft maneuvers with precision and ease. Its vertical takeoff and landing capabilities eliminate the need for runways. This means it can land in the middle of a village, a disaster site, or a narrow alley. The design prioritizes adaptability above all else. It can be configured to carry medical supplies, food, or even small rescue teams. The cargo bay is modular, allowing quick adjustments based on mission requirements. In disaster zones, speed is the difference between life and death. Chikambutso's aircraft slashes response times dramatically. While traditional aid might take days to arrive, this aircraft can deploy within hours. Its autonomous navigation system ensures it operates even in low visibility conditions. Storms, smoke, or darkness won't hinder its mission. Advanced AI guides it safely to its destination, avoiding obstacles in real time. The aircraft is also equipped with real-time monitoring sensors. These sensors assess weather, terrain, and even the condition of delivered supplies. Data is relayed back to command centers, ensuring continuous improvement in aid delivery. The potential to save lives during emergencies is immense. Earthquakes, hurricanes, and conflicts create urgent needs for medical aid. Chikambutso's aircraft can airlift doctors and nurses directly to affected areas. It can also transport portable clinics, vaccines, and emergency blood supplies. In war zones where roads may be blocked or unsafe, this aircraft offers a lifeline. Its silent operation allows discrete deliveries in high-risk areas. For refugees fleeing conflict, timely aid can mean survival. Beyond disaster response, the aircraft bridges gaps in remote communities. Many villages around the world are cut off from basic services. No roads, no electricity, no hospitals, just isolation. Chikambutso's aircraft can change that. It can deliver not just food and medicine, but also educational materials. Books, solar-powered tablets, and even teachers can reach these areas. The aircraft's ability to connect the disconnected is its most profound promise. In regions where children walk miles to school, this could mean access to remote learning. For mothers in labor, it could mean emergency medical evacuations. The ripple effects of such connectivity are immeasurable. Sustainability is at the core of the aircraft's design. Traditional aid missions often leave a heavy carbon footprint. Helicopters and trucks guzzle fuel, contributing to environmental degradation. But Chikambutso's invention operates cleanly, with near zero emissions. Its self-sustaining energy system aligns with global climate goals. Humanitarian aid shouldn't come at the cost of the planet. 
This aircraft proves that efficiency and eco-friendliness can coexist. The technology behind it could inspire greener solutions across industries. Already, energy experts are studying its applications beyond aviation. The implications for renewable energy innovation are vast. Chikambutso's vision extends far beyond a single aircraft. He sees a future where entire fleets operate seamlessly across continents. A global network of self-powered drones, delivering. Hope where it's needed most. Governments and NGOs are taking notice. Pilot programs are being discussed in disaster-prone regions. The potential for public-private partnerships is enormous. But challenges remain. Regulatory hurdles must be addressed to integrate these aircraft into airspace. Safety certifications and international cooperation are crucial. There's also the question of scaling production while maintaining quality. Yet, the momentum behind this innovation is undeniable. Every breakthrough begins with a bold idea. Chikumbutso's aircraft is more than just a machine. It's a symbol of human ingenuity. It represents what's possible when technology serves humanity's greatest needs. As we look to the future, the promise of this aircraft grows clearer. It's not just about faster deliveries or greener energy. It's about redefining what humanitarian aid can achieve. It's about ensuring that no one is left behind, no matter how remote. The story of Chikambutso's aircraft is just beginning, and its impact could reshape the world. The true power of Chikambutso's aircraft lies in its ability to transform humanitarian response. When disaster strikes, every second counts. This aircraft doesn't just deliver supplies, it delivers hope. Picture a hurricane-ravaged coastal town, cut off from the world. Roads are flooded, bridges collapsed, and survivors are stranded. Traditional aid convoys are stuck miles away, unable to reach those in need. But Chikumbutso's aircraft arrives silently, descending like a guardian angel. Its cargo bay opens, revealing stacks of emergency food and water. Nearby, a portable medical unit unfolds, ready to treat the injured. This isn't a distant dream. It's the future of disaster relief. The aircraft's speed and agility make it indispensable in crisis zones. While helicopters require refueling and runways, this machine operates tirelessly. It can shuttle between distribution centers and disaster sites without pause. For famine-stricken regions, that means consistent food deliveries. For epidemic outbreaks, it means rapid deployment of vaccines. The aircraft's versatility extends to search and rescue operations. Equipped with thermal imaging and AI-assisted scanning, it locates survivors effortlessly. In earthquake rubble or avalanche debris, it pinpoints signs of life. Rescue teams can then be directed precisely, saving precious time. The aircraft can even airlift survivors to safety autonomously. Its load capacity is designed for critical evacuations. Stretchers, first responders, and emergency gear fit seamlessly inside. For remote villages, this could mean the difference between life and death. But the impact goes beyond immediate disaster response. In war-torn regions, traditional aid routes are often blocked or dangerous. Convoys face ambushes, checkpoints, and bureaucratic delays. Chikambutso's aircraft bypasses these obstacles entirely. It flies over conflict zones, dropping supplies with pinpoint accuracy. No armed escorts, no negotiations, just aid delivered directly to those in need. This neutrality could redefine humanitarian operations in volatile areas. The aircraft's stealth and silence add another layer of security. It doesn't attract attention like roaring helicopters or trucks. For communities under siege, this discretion is a lifeline. Beyond emergencies, the aircraft bridges the gap for isolated communities. Consider a mountain village, unreachable for half the year due to snow. Families there endure months without medicine or fresh food. With Chikumbutso's aircraft, supply chains remain unbroken. Monthly deliveries of insulin, antibiotics, and prenatal care become routine. Children receive textbooks and digital learning tools. The psychological impact is profound, no more feeling forgotten. This aircraft doesn't just transport goods, it restores dignity. In Sub-Saharan Africa, where millions lack access to basic healthcare, the potential is staggering. 
Mobile clinics could be airlifted to different villages weekly. Doctors could perform telemedicine consultations via onboard systems. The aircraft itself becomes a flying hospital, a classroom, a lifeline. Sustainability remains at the heart of its design. While other aid vehicles pollute, this one leaves no trace. Its energy system is so efficient that excess power can be stored. In remote areas, that means it can even charge local solar grids. Imagine an aircraft that delivers supplies and then powers a village clinic. This dual-purpose functionality is what sets it apart. Environmentalists praise its zero-emission operation. In an era of climate crises, green technology isn't optional. It's essential. Chikambutso's invention proves that humanitarian aid can be both effective and eco-friendly. The long-term implications are even more exciting. Experts believe this technology could spawn a new era of aviation. Self-powered drones could revolutionize not just aid, but global logistics. From delivering mail in remote areas, to transporting lab samples between hospitals, the underlying energy tech might one day power homes and cities. Chikambutso's team is already exploring these possibilities. But for now, the focus remains on humanitarian missions. Stakeholders from the UN to private NGOs are taking notice. Pilot programs are launching in Southeast Asia and Africa. Early feedback is overwhelmingly positive. Aid workers report faster response times and lower operational costs. Recipients speak of the aircraft's quiet arrival, like a whisper of hope. Still, challenges persist. Scaling production to meet global demand is complex. Training local teams to operate and maintain the aircraft takes time. Regulatory approvals vary by country, slowing deployment. And skeptics question the feasibility of such an ambitious project. But history favors the bold. Every revolutionary invention faced doubts before changing the world. Chikambutso's aircraft is no different. The call to action is clear. Governments must streamline policies to embrace this innovation. Investors must fund its expansion to reach full potential. Communities must advocate for its adoption in their regions. This isn't just about supporting a machine, it's about supporting humanity. The promise of Chikambutso's aircraft is a promise of equity. A future where geography no longer dictates survival. Where aid isn't delayed by politics or terrain. Where technology serves the many, not just the few. That future is within reach. As we stand on the brink of this new era, one question remains. Will we seize the opportunity? The answer lies in our collective action. The aircraft is ready. The technology is proven. The need is undeniable. Now it's up to us.